three of the Chart and Chart series of videos that will show the second of two methods for adding I.O. parameters to the new Chart and Chart for use in your PCS7 project. We'll start this second method of creating CNC I.O. parameters with the CFC that contains the CNC open. Right-click in the header area and open the configuration chart. Open the I.O. editing field by clicking on the Chart Inputs Outputs button. Select the N object under the interface area. Select the PV underscore N parameter on the PCS7 discrete N block. Drag the parameter to the next line under the name column in the contents section. Notice here that a new N parameter has been created with the same name as the parameter on the block. The data type has been selected correctly and the block parameter has been wired or connected. It's possible to change the name of the new parameter by selecting the field and making the change. Select the out object, then select the PV underscore out parameter on the PCS7 discrete end block. Drag the parameter to the next line under the name column in the contents section. Change the name as before. Expand the new out parameter. Notice that the structure type was created correctly with the two subparameters value and st. A quick look at the chart input margins shows the typical white triangles that indicate a connection to a chart I.O. The same is true in the chart margin on the output side. Now we'll close the lower or subchart of the CNC. Click on the lower X. This returns our focus to the original CNC where we can now see four I.O. parameters. These parameters can be interconnected like any parameters. The data applied to these parameters is passed to the associated block parameters inside. 